It's more than password, it's password plus. Our guest star from Vegas, Greg Morris and Betty White. And here's the host of Password Plus, Bill Cullen. Oh, How are you? <laughs> thank you for leaving my seat. Oh, thank you. Thank you, hello, and welcome to Password Plus. Betty White and Greg Morris are our guests, and what guests they are. Can we right now meet our players, please? We have Kristen Van Summeren and Barbara Schmidt. <laughs> oh, Kristen. How are you? Hello, oh, Barbara. Well, at, uh, at the, when time was called, first of all, uh, Kristen is our current champion. She has $1,100 plus $100. She's won in this game. First player to score $300 gets a chance to go the alphabetic. So, Kristen, tell us a little about you. Well, I'm from Wilton, Connecticut, and right now I'm a USC student. I'll be going the out east this summer again. I used to be a student at the University of Michigan where I was a cheerleader. I've been trained as a flight attendant, and I've done musical comedy dancing. Holy mackerel, you've been busy for your <laughs> young <it>. years. <laughs> Barbara Schmidt is our other player. Hello, Barbara. Hello. Fill us in on you a little bit. I'm from Albuquerque, New Mexico, and uh, I've done a lot of different kinds of jobs, from road construction to teaching human sexuality at the New Mexico College of Mines, and now I'm uh, learning to be a court reporter. You have the option with this one, so there's your password, and yours, Kristen. Take a look at it at home, if you would, and Barbara, you tell us if you're going to pass or play. I'll uh, play. Slice. Cut. Good clue and good guess. Yes, Greg. Gotta get in there. So the first clue to the puzzle goes up. It's the word cut, and Greg Morris has the guess. Roast beef. Is it? <laughs> is it roast beef? Well, you gotta cut it don't to you, eat it. Yeah, don't you always hate those first clues? They're never that much help. Option stays with you, Barbara. Most of the time they're not. Nothing is positive. Take a look at it. Pass or play. I'll play. Okay. Upset. Stomach. Oh. Boy. That was good, Greg. Great clue. And, and good. Great clue. So, Greg, you guess again. The next clue we have cut and we have stomach. Ulcers. Is it ulcers? No, but it will be. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Barbara, option stays with you. Kristen? For you at home, pass or play? I'll play. Dagger. Knife. No, and Kristen gets a chance to get Betty a clue. Uh, machete. Uh, 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 cut. No, oh, this shoot. is Barbara's last chance, one after this, Barbara. Fencing. Sword. That's oh. it. So, you're still guessing, Greg. The clues now cut, stomach, and sword. Well, have they been to my neighborhood? <laughs> I don't know. He said that. Uh, cut, stomach, sword, uh, fencer. Is it fencer? The game goes on, and the option remains with Barbara. And there's yours, Kristen. For you at home. Pass the plate. <clears throat> I'll play. All right. Homicide. Murder. No, and Kristen gets a chance. Harry Carey. Uh, two-word two clue. Yes. Two-word <laughs> clue. So Betty cannot respond oh, to it. Oh, yes, she It's can. killing her. I know it is. <laughs> Madam Butterfly with you in a moment. Uh, Barbara, you get a chance to give a clue. Self. Suicide. That's it. <laughs> Okay, Greg, you're still guessing. And the clues are cut, stomach, sword, suicide, and your guess is... Harry, carry! It is, and the game is tied. A hundred... You tied it up, Barbara. It's a hundred for you, a hundred for Kristen. We'll be back at Password Plus here in a moment and pick it up. Right now, we have these words for you. Did you know what you Well, that was really great for God. Well, all tied up. $100 for Barbara and for Kristen, and this is a $200 game, so this puzzle 
is for the game. Hey, Betty, you had the option. Oh, good. There We're going to get back in the game, Chris. Frank, sure, you had to have too much of a chance. Take a look at it at home. Um, and, Betty, you're going to pass or play? I'm going to try it. All right. What can I lose? <laughs> Just my career. Um, <laughs> Rex Harrison. Okay, Oops. good try. About that. Greg, your turn. Critic. By golly, it got back to you, Betty. This is your last clue. Rex Reed. Good. That's it. It got back to you. I didn't expect that. Yeah. Kristen, it's your guess now. The clue up there to the puzzle is Reed, and this is for the game. Rex Reed, critic. Is it Rex Reed, critic? Usually, if it were, the name wouldn't be in, up there as a clue. I don't know that oh, for picky, sure, but... picky, picky. Picky, picky. There you are. <laughs> I just thought I'd say, but I know what, actually... Betty gets the option. I'm going to try it. Okay. <laughs> hey. Stack. Good. Good. I'm glad. I'm glad you're going to use gestures there. <laughs> that would have been a gesture. That would have been a gesture. Okay, now it's your turn to guess, Chris, and let me add the clue. This is for the game. We have Reed and we have Stack. And for the game, what say you? How about a shack? Uh, huh? A shack? Is it a shack? Shackery. No? Good try, though. Well, no, not the greatest try in the world, I guess. Thanks. <laughs> I just say that. Better you have the option. Uh, I'll take it. All right. <clears throat> Loretta... Sweat. Oh. Ah. Now then, Greg. Well be... Uh, young. Good. Good clue, good answer. Barbara, you're oh, guessing... Oh, Sweat's gonna kill me. For the game, for the game, Barbara, it's Reed, Stack, and Young. And what do you say for the game? Uh, Roberts. Yes. Is it Roberts? Yes! Here it is, Robert. Famous, Robert. Well done. Kristen, you played well, and we thank you. Thanks so much. Your winnings here on Password plus $1,200. That's really great. Good for you. you. Now then. Barbara. Barbara, you and Greg are going to get a chance now to play alphabetics for $5,000. If you... If you, well, yes, we want you to compose yourself. I'll tell you what. Well, here we are. Barbara Schmidt with that marvelous outdoor look. $300 to the good already. That's in the plus uh, right. column. We have 10 passwords up there, Barbara, beginning with the letter N and going alphabetically all the way through to the letter W. If you get all 10 in 60 seconds, you get $5,000. I know you know how to play. Okay, you ready, Greg? Let's put the first letter up so Greg and I can take a look at it. There's the first word up there. Get a couple of clues, as Alan always says. Got him? Got him. Okay, good luck. You have 60 seconds. Here's your first letter. Go. Wife. Uh, nag. Oh. Uh, man. Uh, clue. Ship. Uh, ocean. Uh. Oceanographer. Oce pass. P. Uh, insect. Uh, M mosquito. Picky. Um, uh, Next. Uh, Next. Was it CT? Q. Um, stomach. Queasy. Oh. Um, Nike. Uh, missile. Uh, Flute. missile. Radar. Next. S. Uh, lamb. Sheep. T. Uh, lean. Thin. Um, bend. Uh, incline. Next. U. Um, next. B. Uh, Italy. Venice. Uh, w. Whale. Water. Uh, uh beard. Animal. Pass. Oh, boy. It's okay. We got, you got some. some you, got, you know, it was very interesting. He said lean, meaning L E A, -A I, and I, lean I over, and you later, took it for a lean L E A and same spelling, but thin. How that happens sometimes. The other words you miss, you want to take a look, they were overboard. That was the man on the ship. Insect was a pest. Nike was a rocket. Lean and tilt. Upset. Forget what I you passed. had for that. And no, I passed. Whale and walrus, they are, are somewhat related. Hard words. They were hard. <laughs> it, it worked out that way, it seemed. Uh, $400, Dumb you celebrity. add to your winnings. No, you did well. <laughs> Happens like that. $700 grand total. And the nice thing is you can go over there and play, and if you win, get back here again. Right. We'll, we'll be back with you in just a moment. Right now, we have these words which sort of pay the freight or passengers. <laughs>
It was a good thing. Come on in, Peter, and say hello. Hello, Frida. Hello. Betty White. And Hello, you know Betty. Barbara, of course. Tell the folks at home something about you, Frida. Uh, Frida Williams, and I live in Tustin with my husband. I'm, um, I have been for years with the Red Cross Blood Program, Los Angeles, Orange County. So I'm now retired, and I like to golf and bowl and work crossword puzzles. Oh, have you come oh, to the right oh, place. Oh, oh yeah, you oh, come to the right, this is a great oh, show for people who like to bowl. There you are, Greg, you have <laughs> the option. <laughs> Most of them. Okay, Greg, take a look at it at home, as you probably already have. Pass or play, Greg? Um, pass. Okay, oh, back to you, Greg babe. Morris, <laughs> gee. Um, um, cacophonous. Noisy. Good. Yes. Good. Oh. Good, good, buddy. Oh. You two are a team, oh. I'll tell you. All right, Barbara. Uh, we put the first clue up there to the puzzle. It's noisy. You get the guess. A riot. Is it a riot? <laughs> no, darn. Option stays with you, though, Betty. There it is. Greg, you have the other. Pass the play, Greg. Oh, you are so Wait, Betty. Oh, no, you have the uh, option. Betty, you have the option. Oh, I beg your pardon. So you'll naturally pass. See, Thank you. Alan, <laughs> we need you, darling. You can't run the show. You understand that. Yeah. <laughs> Be right back, Alan. <laughs> okay. Um, overpopulated. See, Greg, I, I know it could get to you sooner or later. Peopled. Crowded. Good clue. Okay, Frida. Frida, it will be your guess now, and we add the clue. We have noisy, we have crowded. Audience. Uh, it, audience? Audience. Don't take no, that no, no, we're not talking about it's you. It's okay. Is, is it? <laughs> <laughs> hold on, uh, hold on. I must ask, is it the audience? Be oh, funny, thank, the audience. thank Goodson and Jobman. <laughs> now you have the option. There you are, Betty, for you at home. This is what I meant, Greg. I had my times mixed up. Now you pass or play. Um, pass. You got it, Betty. <laughs> You're gonna make me a bigot. <laughs> um, theaters. <laughs> Show places. <laughs> Now I know why Alan took a few weeks off. Uh, Greg, your turn. Stage. Was hers theaters? Theaters, yes. Theaters and stage. Uh, performances? No. Betty gets her final chance at it. Street. Performers? No. Last clue of the game, Greg. Eastern. Broadway? That's it. Right. Yes. Street. I think Frida got it on the street there, and that's a good switch. So, Frida, it's your guess. We have noisy, we have crowded, we have Broadway. Is it New York? Is it New York? It's oh, not. I thought it was, too. I, I thought, oh, sure, you had it, Frida. Greg, the option's yours. Betty, mm. at home? Oh. Pass or play? Pass. Okay, Betty. <laughs> Ball. Bounce? No! Greg? <laughs> <laughs> Corner. Times Square? Good. Yes! Go! Good, Frida. Marvelous. Times the word. That's that is good. putting clues together, huh? I see what it's pretty. Frida, you're playing beautifully. You get another chance. Here are your clues. Noisy. Crowded, Broadway, Times Square for $100. I'm sorry. Okay. I think I finally Everybody have it, and when I have it, you folks at home probably have it too. Greg, the option stays with you. Like the dog in the house probably has it. Greg, you have the option. I'll play it. Okay. Hawaiian... Luau? No. Betty. Um, Maui. What? 
Maui. Maui? Oh, island? Yes, Good. Girl. Good, Barbara. Now, Barbara, you get the guess. And if you miss, Betty gets a chance to back you up. Let me go through the clues for $100. Noisy, crowded, Broadway, Times Square, island. Well, since I have that outdoor look, I know nothing about New York. But I'm going to guess Manhattan. Is it Manhattan? Week. You know something about New York. That's what you do. Yeah. Good. And at the end of the game like that, had you missed, Betty could have backed up. You probably oh, had missed. I'm sure. Sure, oh, Betty was right there with it. Okay, we have a 100 to 0 game. First to score $300 wins the game and goes to alphabetics. Right now, we'd like to pause while we hope you watch these words. How do you watch words? Barbara Smith has 100. Frida Williams has not scored yet, but you're playing a very good game, Frida. You, you have the option this time. Thank you. Barbara, you have the other. Take a look at it at home. Pass the plate, Frida. Old. Ancient. That's good. <laughs> so, Greg, you have to, or you get a chance to guess. The first clue up there is ancient. History. Is it history? <laughs> it is not history. Frida keeps the option. There it is. And yours, Barbara. Going to play? I'll play. Okay. Alive. Alive, uh, existent. No. First chance for Barbara. Existing. Living. That's good. Good clue and a good response. Living. The clues are, Betty, as you guess, ancient and living. It sounds like a television personality I know. No, um, <laughs> um, ancient living uh, coelacanth. Is it coelacanth? <laughs> a what? It's I an don't... ancient living fish that they have found in the Dead oh, Sea. Yeah. They find this funny little fish. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of obvious. Must be. The, the, the fish is living and the sea is dead. Oh, well. <laughs> That's a switch. Barbara, <laughs> you got first shot at it. <laughs> I like this prep work, whatever. Um, I'll play. <laughs> Kosher. <laughs> Hebrew. Oh, oh okay. me. Frida, it's your turn. Yiddish. Kosher, Yiddish, Hebrew, scrolls. Your last clue, Barbara, one after this. Hebrew. It. Jewish. Ah. Oh, that's it. That's it. There's only one left. <laughs> you, you guessed, Betty. The, the clues are ancient, living, Jewish. Uh, the, the, the Dead Sea Scrolls? Is it the Dead Sea Scrolls? <laughs> no. I guess that's a go. contradiction of terms. <laughs> yeah, more or less. It was Barbara your fault. has the you put it in my head. <laughs> uh, I'll play. Okay. Scriptures. Uh, the Bible. Good guess, Betty. Good yeah. All right, Betty, we had a clue. We had ancient, living, Jewish Bible. Is it the, the Torah? Is it the Torah? <laughs> no, and I, I don't know about the people at home. I know I, I admit, I am at this moment at a loss, where I have been for, since 38. <laughs> Frida, it's nice here. Get used to it. Barbara, pass your plate. Pass. Okay, you beat you beat the buzzer. So Frida, you begin. English literature. And Barbara, your first clue now. Speech. Language. Okay. Well, Betty, you get you get a chance. Barbara backs you up. The clues are ancient, living, Jewish, Bible, language. Is it is it Hebrew? Is it Hebrew? It is. Oh! $200. We'll be back here at Password Plus. Right now, we have a word for you. Don't go too far. <laughs> hey, Alan, we've got a password of the day. Bye. 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 <laughs> Some of our contestants will receive Toastmaster System for confection oven does more than you'd expect the true conviction of an also roast bakes broils Toastmaster make it right at home. From Mr. Coffee, a gift pack featuring America's number one coffee maker and genuine Mr. Coffee accessories, including an extra decanter and Mr. Coffee filter. Daisy Foot Saver relaxes tired, aching feet with hot, warm, cold, or dry, vibrating massage furnished by JDZ Product Company. From Hawaiian Tropic comes an attractive beach mat, Hawaiian Tropic natural tanning lotions and oils, Hawaiian Tropic to tan the island. The Andes Ultra.
Reserve for 1400 low dryer and tote brush from the fine Andes line of personal care appliances. Serving professional hairstylists since 1922. Like Mads the manicure says, try mild palm olive dishwashing liquid. Palm olive softens hands while you do dishes. And it makes loads of thick, long-lasting suds. And the representative our studio audience will receive, Pioneer wears ladies and men's matching coats. A rugged western look in genuine cowhide leather furnished by Pioneer Wear. This is Gene Woods speaking for Password Plus, a Mark Goodson, Bill Todman production.